guys it's nikki welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if you're new and in today's video as you can tell by the title we are going to be talking about the best and worst dress of the vmas 2020 the mtv video music awards now i am not a fashion expert as you can probably see throughout my channel i feel like i wear the same damn thing because i'd be so comfortable but um i am very interested in fashion i love fashion i love looking at people being fashionable while i'm just like eh but i'm working on stepping up my style or whatever i've been putting some outfits together because i just i don't know i just think as i get older like i just want to be just more stylish i've just kind of always been like that to where i just always wanted to be a little bit more stylish so but today's video we are going to be going through the 2020 vmas looks now i have this article from vogue that i believe has all of the looks and if i don't have all of the looks not my fault i don't even think there are that many people on the carpet anyways um i think they played it very safe when it came to that. So happy to see that so let's just get into these outfits so the first one is a bella hadid now I love this look when I first saw it I was like wow she just looks so good she's giving me very like 90s y2k vibes like I love everything about it like the top the pants the hair everything ties into each other and I think it looks so good and I also like how she did this in the color black I don't know I think it looks really good and I really really like it so I would give this outfit probably like a 9 out of 10 10 out of 10 I I honestly really love this look when I saw it I was like oh I like that that's fashion next up we have Miley Cyrus she is in Mugler now when I first saw this I didn't know how I felt about it but I'm not gonna lie I actually really like it I'd probably give this like an 8 out of 10 but I feel like it's so Miley and she looks so good with just like a classic red lip and her hair like she just looks very very good first of all her performance was great too I downloaded the song because I said it's a bop but I really like this look I love just like the off the shoulder kind of like tube top and then like the half sleeve like I love it all I love the see-throughness of it I, I love it all I really really like this look I love the simple like strapped heel I love the simple um kind of choker necklace like I said with the red lip the red lip really like pops with this so I really really like that and I think she went into in a good direction with this look next up we have Lady Gaga now Lady Gaga <laughs> If you've been sleeping under a rock, um, you wouldn't know that Lady Gaga gives it to you every single red carpet she attends. And this is no different. I love this like spaced out look. I love that bubble she has over her head. I feel like she's probably signifying like wearing something over your face or like a mask because she did um, reiterate that throughout the show as she was collecting her multiple awards because queen. And so I really like this. I don't understand like her and Ariana Grande, how do they wear them like really high platform shoes? Like how do they walk comfortably? Like, how do you walk a red carpet in them high heels? Like that's iconic. Anybody who does that, iconic. But I really actually really like this look. I love this hair color on her as well. I was looking at it also during like her full performance. I love that hair color and the makeup I think is so pretty. It's very simple but nice glam. I really really like it for her. And I love just like this all silver kind of spaced out look. I think it's very cute. I, I like it a lot. Oh I exited out of the thing. So next we have The weekend. I believe that this, if I'm not mistaken, you can totally correct me if I'm wrong, I think this is from um, the song that he performed beginning. I think it's called Blinding Lights. I like the song, I haven't downloaded it, I just don't know like, the name name, but like y'all correct me if I'm wrong. I really like his fit, I like how he kind of like went with the whole theme of his performance. His performance was so good, oh my gosh, probably one of the best performances of the night. And what a way to start off the show, what a way to start off the show, those fireworks and everything. I also did like how, you know, as he was accepting his awards he always mentioned just the injustice in america and you know it's something that we shouldn't forget about so i'm happy that he used his voice to keep talking about it on on a night that he knew that a lot of people would be watching but i do i don't mind his outfit especially because it was kind of like in theme with like his performance and everything um they did really great with like the face makeup and everything i think it was really cool so yeah uh the next one is the baby now the baby seems very like so he's very like 
casual like chill casual but dripped out like he got Dolce and Gabbana on I could see that on his hat and he got Louis Vuitton shorts like who wouldn't want to chill in damn Dolce and Gabbana and Louis Vuitton? Um, but I actually, I actually like the simplicity of his look. I feel like with the VMAs, people don't go like people go for more of like their personality and like uh, just theme of the year. If that makes sense, I feel like they don't go. Oh my god, I have to be like high fashion. Like it's like what's on trend almost, you know? I don't mind his outfit at all. Very chill, but also very like drippy. Like you see how that drip? I mess with it, but. Yeah, he look good as always, because I'm not going to lie, the baby is like my baby. Like, but we're not going to get into that. Next, we have Doja Cat in Versace. <sighs> 10 out of 10, I totally recommend. We cannot sit here and lie and say that Doja Cat did not serve looks the entire night. Oh my gosh, this first look in this dress was so beautiful. I freaking loved her hair. Oh, the baby hairs and even the makeup, amazing. She looks gorgeous. She looks stunning. And I think it was very nice fitting on her and even with like the long necklace I love I love the hoops everything looks so good and even her performance outfits so freaking amazing she had an amazing performance she looked so beautiful last night um, so I 10 out of 10 because she looked gorgeous we have next CNCO giving me just very boy bandish you feel me like kind of like chill vibes but like I said I kind of expect that at the VMAs you know I don't know I don't expect like top tier oh my god but I also I don't know but I don't mind it um they look dope I've never heard their music before yeah let me know if I should take them out but yeah they look dope but yeah I don't mind their outfits at all I also I actually especially really like the jean outfit with the guy with the red hair I don't know his name sorry I also like that plaid like that pink plaid jacket in the back i actually like all of their outfits i can't even flag each of them has a different element that makes it nice i'm not gonna lie so i like that we have maluma and versace maluma is a very nice looking man <laughs> and he got some good music i was listening last night i said okay i like this very simple all black not much to it but also very like sleek and fashionable but not overbearing i like it a lot so that's a good one i'll give that one like a i'll give the boy band I believe their boy band. I'll give them like an 8 out of 10. I'll give Maluma probably like an 8 out of 10 as well. We have the Black Eyed Peas. Um, I don't know how I feel about the Black Eyed Peas outfits. I mean, they're not bad. Yeah, I don't know. I like, you know, Will I Am wearing his mask, but next okay so madison beer and mugler now so i was kind of shocked to see that this was mugler i mean it's a beautiful outfit but it's giving me very damn am i getting a drag for this it's giving me very like fashion like i know fashion nova is going to come out with a version of this um it's cute but it's giving me very like party vibes glamorous party i guess but like i said for the vmas you're kind of you're not like dressed oh my god but you're also not dressed down so she's kind of in the middle so i guess she fits i would give her an outfit like a seven out of eight i mean she looks beautiful um i love her hair down actually it looks really pretty i actually have one of her songs like recently that i really like but um i don't know it's just not like it's not like um like the other outfits that we've seen i feel like i feel like the other outfits give you more like okay we're at the vmas you know we're coming to serve and i feel like she was like i'm coming to to come i don't know how to explain it do you get me but she looks gorgeous as always so next we have joey king and versace now period you're dripping in versace but like i just feel like it's kind of basic it's very beautiful and she looks great but i feel like it's kind of like basic but i also really love the chain aspect to it so i would give this outfit like a seven out of eight seven eight out of ten because like the chain aspect really helps you know like this is versace baby like don't play me but it's pretty though i love i do love floral so i do love the floral detailing i just feel like it's something that's a little basic but my girl is dripping next we have travis barker not really my style if i'm being honest with you i mean pretty laid back and chill but not really my style like with the whole plaid pant i don't know but it's very like chill but it's nothing bad but i don't think that's like my style that i'd like to see on the artist machine gun kelly now i actually liked how he like he wore like all pink i am not gonna lie i might have to give this outfit like an eight or a nine 
Because this was not a bad outfit. I also like how he's on the red carpet with his little turtleneck. And he has his jacket. Like, I feel like he's, like, he's giving me looks right now. I'm not going to flag. He's giving me looks. And I'm like, okay. Bet. I'll take it. And I also like this performance. I, um, If I'm not mistaken, his performance was very, like, alternative. And I really liked it. I love, I love all different genres of music. So I really like that as well. Next we have Nicole Richie. See, this is where the more dressed up aspect comes in, but I love this look. Nicole Richie looks gorgeous. I love the heel. I love the dress. I honestly really like this look. Um, next we have Sophia Carson. A little too dressy, I think, for the VMAs, but she also looks very beautiful. So like, like the last two, like Nicole Richie and Sophia Carson were more on the dressy side, but they look very gorgeous in their gowns. So I love that. Jaden Smith. I really actually like Jaden Smith's outfit. I love the pink glasses aspect and I love his jacket. I love it all. I'm not going to lie. I really like this outfit. When I saw him go like and do his little interview, I really, really was enjoying his outfit. He looks good. It's me, maybe, but whatever. But yeah, looks very good. I, I really like this. Next we have BB Rexa. I can't really see her full outfit, um, but her hair looks good. Her nails are cute. I mean, from the top, it looks pretty cute. I think it's giving me very like VMAs vibe, so I like that. And hi, Nikki editing. So I realized Ariana Grande had posted a video or a picture from home in like a VMAs outfit. So I'm gonna add that in here. I think her outfit was so cute. Her hair was so cute. I literally loved it when I saw it. My jaw dropped. She looks stunning. And I'll give her outfit, honestly, like a 9 out of 10, 10 out of 10. She looked so good. It suits her and her style so well. It suited the hairstyle that she decided to wear. And she wore it beautifully, period. Queen. The best. Love it. And then we have our host, Miss Kiki Palmer. And she slays as always. Um, I love this baby blue, like the sky baby blue. I love the big, like diamond choker i also love the big ass bow slit 10 out of 10 beautiful i freaking love it she looked gorgeous the entire night oh she did a great job at hosting as well so i'm happy that she was able to take on that role and she just looked great and like i think she had different outfits she looked great in all of them she looked great so and she even performed as well period but yeah um, let me know what you guys think of these outfits down below. What did you think of VMA's fashion this year, especially for being in quarantine? Like, I believe that these were all the people that walked the carpet. I'm not completely sure. If there's more, you guys can let me know. I, you know, I think that they did very good for us, like, being in, like, quarantine and stuff. And even with the performances, like, this is, I've said this last night when I was reacting to the performances, but it really took, made artists go into the creative element, and I really like to see that. So, you guys let me know down below <sighs> i think the best dressed for me i really want to say bella hadid because i love the 90s like why to early 2000s like you know vibe but i must say lady gaga's outfit was so ex extraordinary and she looked so good throughout the entire night i feel like last night was her night so i'm gonna give the best dress to her let me know what you guys think what who's your favorite dress who's your worst dressed and such and what did you enjoy about the vmas last night so let me know down below um don't forget to like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more videos like this on like best and worst dress or like rating outfits you guys let me know because i do love fashion so you guys let me know and i will see you guys in the next one don't forget to interact in the comments down below and like this video and share i'll see you guys in the next one Bye.
to 